There's nothing like a driving holiday. Getting out on the open road, cruising along, taking in the sights, just... Or getting to where you want to be fast and easy so you can start partying. Either way, there are a few simple things you should check over before you start out to make sure it doesn't turn into the driving holiday from hell. For starters, make sure your car's servicing is up to date, whether you do that yourself or not. If you're going to rack up a few Ks and it's getting close, it might be a good idea to get it done a little early rather than a little late. You need to have at least two millimetres of tread on each tyre for them to be safe. That's about a match head deep. If any of your tyres is close to that, consider replacing them. Tyres should also be inflated to the correct pressure. That should be in your owner's manual, including the spare. And make sure you've got a functional jack and wheel brace. The spare's not much good without them. Check that your wipers work and that the blades aren't split or perished. If they leave a smear across the windscreen, you need to replace them. On the open road, you will get bugs and grime on the windscreen, so make sure your washer jets are pointed the right way and that the reservoir is full. An additive in the reservoir will help to get the gunk off. Check that all your lights and indicators are working properly. If you don't have someone to help you with that, try to back up to a mirror or some other reflective surface so you can check that out yourself. Right. Other right. You should also make sure that all your engine warning gauges and lights are working properly. Turn the ignition on and check that all the warning lights that should be on are and that they turn off after the engine has started. If you don't, you could have a problem and should get it checked out. Under the bonnet, make sure your battery is held securely in place and that the terminals are clean and dry. Give all your drive belts a once-over, checking the tension and for excessive cracks or wear. While the engine's cold, check your oil level and top it up if needed. Don't overfill as that can cause damage. And also check your coolant level in both the radiator and the expansion tank and have a look at your hoses. If they're cracked or look a bit worn, they might need replacing. It's also worth checking that all the clamps are tight. Are we there yet? We are, actually. Oh, good. It's also wise to carry a few things with you, just in case. Some water for both you and the car. A decent torch with some fresh batteries. Electrical tape. It uh, holds the world together, after all. Fuses and a small amount of electrical wire. A tow rope or strap. And some basic tools. An adjustable spanner, a Phillips head screwdriver, a straight blade oh, and a pair of pliers can get you out of most things. And a first aid kit. It's always a good idea. So there you go. You'll find a link to print off a PDF of this checklist on this page. Have a good trip. And remember, we're, we're here, here to help. help.